Warden Axel, to fulfill my lord's ambition of usurping the regime, we must first take over Hades. It shall be used as our foothold for further invasions, from our proletariat seat of power to the very executive office of the president. Cease this futile battle now. Upon your surrender, we may or may not grant you a valid position as well. Really? You will? What kind of position? Comic relief? <laughs> That's perfect. Damn it! You know what? Screw you guys! I want to see you try to talk like that after you see what's behind this barrier! Are you sure about this, Warden? What's gonna happen now? Everything will be fine, young master. We'll quell these anarchists together and earn our reputations back. Then I'll get promoted to a higher position than Hades Warden, and eventually... <laughs> Which one of you fools reopened this basin in Hades? I don't know who you think you are, but I hope you're ready to face and be torn apart by the most devastating and catastrophic abomination of your life! I am the fear. I am the dread. I am the disaster. I am the calamity. And most of all, I am... She who sunk the world into blazing chaos! The final weapon! Disco! She's... The final weapon? The final boss already? This is so lame! Wait a second. Have I seen her before? Now come and challenge me, hero! I'll implant the grimmest despair into the deepest pit of your soul! <laughs> Before we start, let me tell you something. I am not a hero! Huh? You're not a hero? So you're not Desko's enemy? Yes, he is! They're all your enemies! Go ahead and give them despair or whatever it is you do! And who are you? Oh, thanks for asking! I'm Warden Axel, the most powerful demon in Hades! No, you're wrong! Desko is the most powerful, because Desko is the final boss! No! I'm the most powerful! I'm the all-powerful warden! That's the monster that all of the prisoners were so scared of? I don't understand. Hmm... Seriously, I think I've seen her before. I can't remember where. Final boss is supposed to fight a hero. I'm not gonna waste my time on some peons. Oh, stop complaining. Just follow orders and get rid of them, like any final boss would do. Okay then. Desko will kill you all, just like a final boss would do. First, I'll start with you. He died again. No! Warden Axel! Ah, uh, now 
I remember. She's the monster who attacked me! What? Are you saying she's the one who killed you and sent you to Hades? I'm not dead! I bet this nightmare was caused by her knocking me unconscious. Oh, it's her! Desko must impress her. Are you ready? <laughs> Fear me, you fools! And realize that only heroes can defeat a final boss! Now, who wants to die next? Is it you? Uh, what? Don't look at me! Stop! I'm the son of the president! <laughs> Disappear! Help! Someone help me! A am I still alive? You! You, Desco! If you want to call yourself a final boss, then keep this in mind. A strong defense is fundamental. You must first receive your opponent's attacks in a dignified manner. Uh, really? But Desco had no idea. It is absolutely unacceptable for you to deal lethal damage on your first turn! It completely ruins the balance of the game! I cannot approve of someone like you being the final boss. In fact, no one would approve of such a lousy game if it had that! As expected of my lord, that must be the most biased opinion I've ever heard! A final boss must annihilate every single living creature. That's what it said in the textbook that Desko's daddy gave her. That's such a lie. I've never heard of any textbooks like that before. It's not a lie. Desko is a final boss. I'll kill you all! Oh. 
have mercy? Huh. Here I come! Thank <laughs> you. 
by Odin's beard? They defeated that monster! Tyrant Valvatoris! He is for real! How in Hades did he regain his power? Which legend says he lost? Sardines, of course! Sardines? Absolutely. You guys should indulge in them as well. They will make you stronger. against an enemy who wasn't even a hero! So... so... does that mean that Desko isn't a final boss after all? Is she going to be abandoned... again? <laughs> what? Did you say abandoned? Cast out from the human world and abandoned because she's useless. The human world? You mentioned something earlier about being the final weapon. Were you, by any chance, created by a human? Yes, Desko's daddy is a human. Created. By a human? I mean, that, that, that's absolutely absurd! Uh. Humans have created not just a normal demon, but a final boss, the highest of all demon ranks? What could they possibly be plotting? Why don't they just keep focusing on sardine research? And what is the corrupterman doing allowing the humans to pursue such madness? What is the president thinking? Judging by this blockhead here, I assume the Corruptorment isn't thinking at all. Am I the only one left to do this after all? Must I teach a lesson to the unruly humans as well as the rotten Corruptorment? Yes, my lord. And I believe that usurping the regime is the key to doing both. Huh. Indeed! Then I accept this duty placed before me. Trinies, demons, or humans, I will turn their worlds into Hades to teach them all a good lesson. I hereby declare right here, right now, to overthrow the current corruptment and to Hadefy all worlds by forming the Hades Party! Bravo! Your wish is my command. However, that name sounds a bit too straightforward. We should discuss this later. Come with me, Desko. Huh? But, but Desko isn't really a final boss. Indeed you are not. You're still too inadequate to be a final boss. But I will train you so that one day, you will make a magnificent final boss. But... Desko was defeated. How can a defeated final boss ever become a magnificent final boss? Do not be ashamed of your loss. There are tons of final bosses out there who have climbed their way back after a defeat. Besides, only those who have experienced failure and downfall can become stronger. Really? So, so, should Desko let go of her shame that came with her defeat? Yes. So long as you get right back up after a defeat, you'll be fine. Will Desko be able to fight a final battle against a hero someday? I have no doubt about that. When you become a magnificent final boss and spread your evilness, a hero will surely confront you. Desko be able to pull off three transformations and bribe the hero by offering them half of the world? Of course, if you can keep up with my training. I promise to push you until you obtain the power of a worthy final boss. So, Desko, come with me. Okay, Desko promises.
promises to follow you until she is ready to become a magnificent final boss. Oh, my lord. There goes another one of your promises. No way! She attacked me! How can I be on the same team as some... Desko is going to become a magnificent final boss. I hope I will have your blessings, Big Sis. B big Sis? Yes, Desko's Big Sis. Oh, she's your younger sister. You two better get along then. Absolutely not! Do you see any family resemblance between us two? She said she was created by humans. But you were created by humans as well, correct? Yeah, but I'm the product of the love between my mom and dad. And how dare you make me say that? Uh, guys! They even scouted the final boss into being their teammate! I'm starting to think this regime usurpation thing could actually happen! Let's go, everyone! We're going to turn the worlds into Hades! The battle, which ended with Valva Torres' victory, soon triggers the birth of a new political force that will threaten the entire netherworld. In the future, people will look back at this battle as the rise of the tyrant. But at this point, this is only the beginning of when the world started heading towards corruption. What happened? Oh, oops. <laughs> I almost forgot about him. Hey, you're coming with us too. Huh? Where to? Never mind, that doesn't matter. Why do I gotta tag along with you guys? Why? Don't you know what's going on right now? You should read the newspaper. Your father must be very upset to hear about this news. You should come along to relieve his heart as soon as possible. <laughs> we caught wind of some shocking news after we quelled the brutal criminals of Hades. I can't believe they announced that I died! Sardines are not Glupini. <laughs> They are Clupiformis Clupiodi, to be specific. Who cares? Although Japanese sardines and round herrings are Clupidi, and Japanese anchovies belong to the Angrology gang. The hell? Next time, episode four, Hades Haysayer Army. If you don't trust sardines, make sure you eat their guts too. Desco will be showing off.